According to the priests, they came to visit the Holy Ark of the Covenant, which had been kept on the island by the Ethiopian Jews for about 400 years. These oral and written traditions about the visit of Jesus and Mary have survived for almost 2,000 years now. There are a number of highly revered locations in this area, all having to do with the time Jesus was supposedly here on the island. This very old portrait is a church record of the visit of Mary and Jesus to Ethiopia. The absence of Joseph both in the portrait and the traditions is conspicuous. Could it be that what we are seeing is a true pictorial record of what Jesus and Mary actually looked like? The Ethiopian traditions are very clear on specific aspects of Jesus' visit to the island, where Jesus would play, the very rock where Mary sat. But the traditions are silent as to the age of Jesus at the time of his visit, nor do these traditions ever mention Joseph's presence on the island. This is the first time that the Ethiopian monks have talked publicly about their tradition of Jesus visiting their island. The oral and written traditions in Africa have proven to be very reliable in the past, and that's why this island is considered to be a holy site to this very day by all of Ethiopia.